I got a haircut two days ago and she made me look like Jimmy Neutron. There we go. It's still a little bit. It's fine. Hey everyone, Johnny Andrew here, and today we are talking about some problems that bigger people have. These are things that have literally happened to me. So yeah, just, uh, you know, deal with it. I don't mean like, oh, I can't walk up the stairs because I'm so heavy and I get tired. It's more about things that people say to you and stuff. Right now, firstly, pants. And you've got a nice pair of pants, which is fairly new, and then out of nowhere, it gets this massive hole in the thighs because your legs have been rubbing together. And then you go to the shop and the person looks at you and they go, oh, you're a big boy. You must eat a lot of food. Do you want me to um, sew this for you or are you just gonna buy baggier pants? So the pants. I can wear skinny pants. You can't wear skinny pants. When someone tells me that I should get something healthy, my first instinct is, I'm going to KFC. And you know what? Then the day comes where you're like, today I feel like a salad or today I feel like a sandwich. And you go get it, you bring it back and everyone's like, are oh, you on a diet? That's really good. I hope you stick to this. I just wanted a salad for today. All right, I'm not on a diet. Would anyone else be on a diet for having a salad? I'll go to the doctor and I'll be like, doctor, my ear is hurting so much. I think I have an ear infection. I really need help. You know what? You need to lose a little bit of weight. I actually can't hear out of this ear. It's stinging. I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe from my ear. I'm going to put you on this tablet. It's going to help you lose some weight. All right. Thank you so much. See you next time. Here's the prescription. Oh, or when people try and guess your size and they look at you and they go, extra, extra, extra large. Another weird one is that there's a lot of people that maybe I don't speak to in a while or whatever. And you're like, how's your diet going? I've never said I want a diet. Who's on a diet? Where do they, where do, where do people get this from? I don't understand. I go to church, love church, and um, they do fasting. So for a, a month or for whatever, you take something out of your life that's a temptation for you and you use that time where you'd normally do that to pray to God, blah, blah, blah. But... When people start saying to you like, so are you going to be fasting fast food? Are you going to be fasting chocolate? Are you going to be fasting soft drink? I'm going to be fasting being a good person. I already started. I've started today. These are rude. You're rude. rude. Why am I talking like that? People always think the fat one is the one that farted. You ever hear like, and then everyone just... Do fat people fart more? I don't know. I don't bloody fart ever. If you want to win, keep it within. Another thing is old people. Old people, they don't they don't really have boundaries of things they can and can't say. So if they come into your office, they go, have you seen John, the, the large one? You know, the, the large guy, the really big one, the big fat, ugly dog. Hi. What do you want today? Oh, I just want a discount. I think I deserve a discount. Well, you can shove your discount up your big grandpa up. While filming this, I've been thinking that I'm being a little bit too serious, just so you know, I don't really care about anything, ever. So...